Welcome guys to another video on Nikkei Goddess of Victory. Now in today's video what we're going to be doing is testing out the two new characters and going over if they are better than the bunny girls. Uh, so that is Naga as well as Tia. Now I've actually invested a lot into Tia because I was kind of figuring out what was the issue of Tia because one issue we had was that she kept dying. She just kept dying over and over again and I was trying to test it out, figure it out and then it turns out you need to get her first skill to level 7 before you can actually see how good she is because if you didn't get to level 7 she becomes a issue in the team so i've probably titled this video naga and tear has one major issue the major issue is for them to work you have one major pre prerequisite and that is to get her skills to level 7. now because i was trying to figure out what would make her better i already invested into her skill 2 and, and her burst skill so i've invested into her a lot now now that she has the ability to survive is she now better than the bunny girl now if you don't have her to level seven she just dies and she becomes actually garbage not really garbage but in like testing her into interception and normal story mode she just like with high cp she just dies um so therefore you have that issue so in terms of is that better than the bunny girls the answer is no however now that i have her up at level seven for her skill one and the buffing capabilities of them is better than the bunny girls the answer now is yes they are better than the bunny girls that is something we're going to be testing out right now so how we're going to be testing them out is going into interception going into union uh, shooting range and uh, we have our answer so this is the current team i use now this is before this was actually done before i leveled up her her skills to level seven eight and seven but i was able to beat my record that i had with the bunny girls with blanc and noir now i've actually invested into blanc and noir significantly but now that i've actually worked on my uh tr i think it's tr not tier but tr um they are now on the same level so 477 and noir was uh 884 so let's go ahead and see it but i have more overload gear so 884 over here but now that i have this character like leveled up this way um i don't even think you need to overload her but i got charge speed so i'll take that and then this is the team i'm currently using um i could improve on naga since everything's just 444 so yeah definitely could improve even more especially with the burst skill over here i could definitely increase this so um i'm gonna invest in them later on but we're gonna see how much damage they can do like this what i've kept the same was litter so i did the same team without naga and tear and instead added the the bunny girls and um yeah the the naga and tr was able to output more damage by like 20 20 million more 30 million more compared to my bunny girls so let's go ahead and see how much damage we can do right now hopefully we should be able to beat our record actually before that let's go ahead and, ahead and understand the skills um tear provides us with shield has the ability to increase uh let's say look cooldown of burst skills reduced um uh let me go over to here has the ability to taunt cover increase cover max hp recovers um as well and then with the last one re-enters burst skill one if you have litter you're able to re-enter as well litter now gives you an extra damage buff as well um generates a shield as well and then when it comes to naga she basically buffs you up if you have a shield so recover of cover hp now you have three units in this team with the ability to recover or yeah recover cover um hp which is Lita, tia and naga so they work well together um second one activates okay so basically deal more damage to attacking cores uh recover max final hp and then the last one you basically affect all allies increase their attack i definitely need to upgrade this one actually so we're going to retry this so we have a fresh start we go into this we see how great the damage is if you guys are enjoying this video or you want to see more content on nikkei goddess of victory oops i need to do this again make sure you are subscribed to the channel and make sure that post notification is on if you guys enjoyed this video go ahead and click the like button as well help show your support as well let's go ahead and get 40 likes in today's video until Tell me down in the comment section if you guys got lucky with your summons for both um, Tia and Naga. If you guys are wondering should you summon, the answer would be if you guys have the bunny girls, 
I wouldn't say Naga and Tia are a must have then because the bunny girls really work. They work. Then nothing can change that. But Naga and Tia are better. That's their main answer. But the reason why I'm hesitant to, into telling you guys to definitely summon for both of these characters is because there's two characters you need to summon for. And let's not forget we have Anniversary coming up very, very soon. Probably going to be a program character. You don't want to miss out on that. So I, I think you need to save your resources so answer is very very difficult if you guys have enough resources to burn then sure but if you're free to play probably wait for anniversary they should be added adding naga and tia into the standard banner or into the regular pools so you might have a chance to pull them later on so uh fingers crossed you can get them okay so we are about 25 seconds left so let's see how this goes we should be able to break our record again hopefully um Maybe not. Maybe the buffing was not that great. Oh, why are we doing significant? We did less this time. But like I said, I should upgrade Naga. Uh, she is the one that gives more damage buff. So we will be able to get better damage if I upgrade my Naga. She's still at 444. We weren't able to beat it, but oh, we were able to beat it slightly. Um, but let's go ahead and see. So the damage buff. 80 okay there we go and i think i do think the reason why we're able to do extra damage was because Litsa was able to give us that extra um increase in attack so there we go with that one uh what i want to do now is go into interception i haven't tested this out since i've gotten her to level seven there was one major issue which she just died every single time in interception but now that i have her at level seven i am hoping this is not an issue anymore so this is the exact same team i made a mistake i didn't press mock battle last time but we're going to be doing that right now so let's go ahead and see if we can go ahead and beat this with no issues fingers crossed um the major issue like i said was like you needed to get that to level seven like this is not the only character with a prerequisite like that there is several other characters in this game where you need to get some of their skills to a certain level to fully utilize them but i feel like with tier it's a much more important one compared to any one of them because she just dies and you literally can't use her um so yeah okay she typically dies at when we reach five and then seven so five stage five and then seven but i don't think oops let's make sure we kill this um shoot this down okay she's not dying so that's good Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, we are six, so let's get to stage seven. She died last time I did this, so let's hope we don't. Okay, good. Oh, she did not die. Okay, we are good. She is able to survive, and that's all that matters. Okay, great. Definitely get this to uh, to level seven. It's very important. She just goes kaput. She's just not good. Trust me on that. Um. So yeah, I'm happy with that. Oh are we about to get a no good she manages to get into our burst before anything happens great 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 okay um wait a minute am i gonna beat this fast i really doubt this but anyway oh why did i have a issue with that that was weird i never have an issue like that anyways we're close to the end anyways that was weird then again i'll just emptying out everything oh that's because i don't have i usually use the bunny girls and i get an extra ammo count with the bunnies where with noir so that's why i was not used to reserving my ammo instead of just pressing it so it's not it's not naga it's not tia's fault that she died it was actually my fault i'm too used to using the twins uh did not twins the bunny girls um so yeah okay conclusion very very good able to buff very very nice uh go over to Okay, I'm gonna try and do this. Now, my CP requirement is very, very low. Uh, my power, sorry, compared to the recommended. So uh, we are gonna attempt this, but if we die, it is not TS fault. It is just probably the stage is way too difficult to actually try. So let's go ahead and see. So they're missileless as well. So the, the bunny girls are in a Tetra line, and now we have a missileless characters that are similar to that. So that would actually be cool to uh try this on the okay good 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 nice hopefully since she has um taunting ability she i am worried she might die guys okay last time she got obliterated oh she's not dead okay i'm, I'm so happy last time she got obliterated and she just died <laughs> now we're able to oh my days i'm happy with them now they are actually very very good 
once you get um, tier two or to level seven. Last time she got obliterated a lot faster, but okay, yeah, I think it's due to our CP requirement, uh, our our power not being that great. But yeah, I'm happy with them. Um, very very happy. Okay, that's that's what all the testing I wanted to do. Um, compared to the bunny girls, the answer isn't like a clear. Oh yes, they're definitely better. It's more like. The difference between them having the bunny girls compared to Nagantier, it's mainly like a maybe like a ten percent increase. I mean, just 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 me spitting out random numbers, but it feels like a ten percent, like they're better by like ten percent, maybe maybe like a ten percent or five percent. It isn't a huge amount, like it completely destroys the bunny girls. It's not like that. They are still very very strong characters to use. In fact, I do think it might just be a lot easier to use Blank on Noir compared to using Nagantier, simply because like. Sometimes you do have to worry about Tia still dying, but with, because I feel like it's because of the taunting, she taunts a lot of like damage towards herself. Um, but then again, I also haven't leveled up her uh, gear too much. But actually, I've invested more into Tia than I have with Blanc. That's extremely weird. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. Anyways, that's all I wanted to make it, uh, talk about in today's video. Stay tuned for more content on Nikki Goddess of Victory. It's been your boy AC Gamer. Wish you guys luck on your summon.